Hey, what's up? I'm Ashley. Thank you for watching this video. And today we're going to be talking about 20s, season two, episode nine. Marie and Chuck finally broke up. I saw it coming and it finally came. They both said that the thought of marrying each other does not make them happy, but it makes them nervous. And I'm here for it. In my opinion, this relationship has been dragged out for too long. It's time to see other people. So Marie told Zach that her and Chuck broke up, but Zach didn't give her the reaction that she wanted. All Zach had to say was, I'm so sorry. And Marie was like, is that all you have to say? He was like, you want more? I was like, ooh. He tells Marie that he has respect for her, but doesn't want this to get awkward. He just wants them to thrive and make good movies. And I'm like, what does that mean? Why is he over here acting like he don't want Marie all of a sudden? Why the change of heart? This making me mad. And Marie also found out that Quintel has a baby on the way. And she was shook. She didn't see that coming. It looks like her options are disappearing fast, but y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comments. And Hattie is going to mess things up with Adina. She's still over here entertaining Alicia. And she's going to get caught up. While she was texting Alicia, she was right there with Adina. Adina was like, what's wrong with you? What you doing? And Hattie was like, I got to go. I was like, I know she's not about to go meet up with Alicia, but she got a call from her dad and she ended up meeting up with him. But not before she talked to her mama about it. Her mama was like, don't give him no money. What he won't. You haven't seen him in 10 years. I don't know what's going on with her dad, but I don't trust him. Maybe he wants something from Hattie. She was telling him that she has a manager now. She wants to be a writer. He was like, oh, you're trying to be like your dad because I write too. I write comedy and told her that he wanted her to come to one of his shows. She told him that she would think about it, but he made her say either yes or no. So she ended up saying, yeah. I'm like, dang, can somebody think about something and make up their mind later? But then she goes back to Adina's house and Adina's like, are you ready to tell me what was wrong with you earlier? And then that's when Hattie told her that she met up with her dad that day. She asked Hattie when's the last time that she saw him. She was like, when I was 15. The whole meeting was a little weird, but he wants me to come to his show. And Hattie asked Adina to go with her to his show. And Adina was like, are you sure? And Hattie was like, yeah, I already told him about you. And that made Adina feel good inside. But she don't know that Hattie is over here entertaining Alicia. And Hattie might end up cheating on her. But y'all let me know what y'all think about Hattie, her daddy, Adina, and Alicia down in the comments so ben ended up quitting his job like he always wanted to do he pitched an idea to zach and marie and they wasn't really feeling it and he told them that he wants nia to be in his movie and that she's ready marie agreed but told him that nia's not a name yet and they need someone bigger so ben told them straight up either you make my movie or i'm quitting so he quit he told Nia and Marie that he's going to start his own production company in his garage for now for like a year and told Nia that he still wants to work with her and Nia is open to the idea. Nia was telling Marie that she's proud of him and thinks it's sexy that he's taking his life into his own hands. And I said, okay, girl, let him know too. And finally, Nia's sister tells her that the reason why she's over there so much is because she's having problems with her husband at home and she's having problems getting pregnant. Her husband has a low sperm count. She told him that she's open to adoption, but he's not even trying to hear it. Nia told her that she can stay with her as long as she wants, but her sister was like, I gotta go home and face my problems eventually. I knew something was up with her and her husband. I was just waiting for her to say it. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this episode down in the comments. And also don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already and you want to see more videos like this thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in my next one